Hey, so here's a quick update for my Poison Concoction League starter. So I'm basically just right before I'm starting to map, which, oh, I just realized I can't do my head out. I need to go back to town. Anyway, so uh, let's take a look at it. And yes, that's a six link, which I dropped in Act 9 in Boiling Lake by empowering the um, Basilisk or whatever it's called with my trusty Apex Sentinel. So all hail Sentinel. Really cool so far. Um, yeah, so as I said, Sentinel or it's quite fine. I can't really complain about it. I mean, not mentioning the lucky drop, it's fine. I tried it a little bit while leveling. Can be quite dangerous if you just happen to empower a blue pack with dangerous Arch Nemesis modifiers, so um, keep that in mind. That was um, ooh, tough. Also, it didn't kill me. Yeah, but Arch Nemesis is um, quite dangerous. Some <laughs> rares with the right modifiers or a combination of red modifiers, especially if, say, um, something like Magma Barrier killed me once because I got trapped by a blue Frost Barrier pack and then I got one shot by that Magma Barrier dude, which was, you know, disappointing. But luckily I'm just playing SSF and not hardcore, so I'm fine. Great. Anyway, as I said, um, Sentinel is fine so far. It's not too much work pressing a button every now and then or two in a map. Oh, that's kind of cool. I do enjoy it so far. Uh, where was it? Here. I haven't done much yet. I'll just need to unlock uh, another Pandemonium so I can use um, the third one. Yeah, Pandemonium Sentinel. It's fine. I mean, probably once I get it properly running in maps, it's gonna be a bit better. And uh, yeah, also I probably should get some good Sentinels first before I get something really nice from that. Okay, um, yeah, as for Arch Nemesis, it's cool. The monsters are tough, especially if you run into Riath with three modifiers or in maps four you know give them some essences and you probably don't want to even look at them because they are insanely tanky probably a bit too tanky and that should probably be you know fixed later on but so far it's quite fine i did want to spec into essences but considering how tanky they are yeah maybe my i mean i'm lucky i have a six link but if i wouldn't have a, a six link I probably wouldn't spec into essences right now. So yeah, or at least that's what I'm planning. I still have to do maps first before I even get to essences. Anyway, as for my build, I'm level 65, uh, 3.2k life, which is fine. Um, my resists are okay-ish, hold not so much, but as I said, I don't play hardcore. So. Considering I also have a six link, I'm fine with taking the risk, not dying. I mean, yeah, I have nice movement speed, so that's good. Can run away if it's. So basically, if I run into anything that is even remotely doing cold damage, I just, you know, ignore, run away as fast as I can, so I don't die. Um, as for my gear, it's serviceable at best. You know, nothing special. All okay-ish gear could be better, but. Once I get into maps, it should be easy to upgrade most of those pieces. Also, the helmet is quite nice. And obviously, a six link. Obviously, it's for me, it's strictly better than Tabula Rasa, so I'm quite happy about that. Especially about a uh, good resist roll, which I desperately need. Especially called. My flasks are still fine. Yeah, I mean, they do work sort of, kinda, for my poison, poison concoction. Right. Um, Let's take also a quick look at the passive tree. I basically, for uh, what's it called the last lap, Uber lap, yes, whatever. Um, I don't want to take Nature's Reprisal. I was originally planning to take that first and send spec into Master Toxicist until I have set up all my flasks to get um, charges on hit. Then I can um, take Iron Reflexes and then I would have spec into Master Surgeon. But because I already have, you know, six link and Plenty of damage, I just skipped it and went straight into here. Now I just need to fix up my flasks. I only have one so far to get charges on hit. I just need that for the other three. Although I do want to change this dip net for a chain flask later. And maybe my granite flask 
or well i keep the grand flask and only change it to any of the um ruby or topaz or sapphire flasks or the, uh, elemental flasks if i need more elemental protection for certain bosses i suppose and yeah um the tree is fine so far um still a lot to go i could spec into some additional resistances here if i really am too uncomfortable with my cold resist but yeah um so far i'm quite happy as i said sentinel is okay my build runs quite nicely and arch nemesis modifiers are cool so far maybe a, need a bit more balancing but um i can probably tell more about it once i get into maps and get my character properly going anything else to mention not really that's the build i'll leave a link down for my pub um link for my pub down below 